Hi, I'm Stephanie Conter O'Hara, Licensed Professional Counselor, Owner of Well-Minded Counseling, and I'm here to interview today Paige Leedy, Licensed Clinical Social Worker. Um, Paige, I'm just going to start the interview off by asking the first question. Uh, why did you decide to become a therapist? Yeah, um, well, let's see here. So I have always been kind of the type of person who likes to help people, um, like since I was a little kid, a uh, conflict mediator type situation on the playground. Um, and I grew up and I always knew that that was kind of just my destiny. And so um, initially I went to cosmetology school and I was like, I need to do more than just make people feel pretty. Um, so I went to I went to college and I explored both psychology and social work. Social work ended up being my jam because um, essentially it looks at not just the person who's hurting in front of me, but also all the different systems um, that impact them and can also be causing some of the, the issues going on in their life, whether it's school, family, their um, health, their employment. Um, so uh, I. I pursued that education and uh, here I am at Well-Minded now. Well, thank you so much for that and giving us a little background about why you chose social work over um, psychology. What is your general philosophy and approach to helping others? And do you find yourself to be more directive or guiding? Yeah, um, I definitely feel like I'm more guiding than directive. Um, I tend to use um, our relationship in therapy to kind of uh, draw upon your strengths um, and kind of get get you the help that you're needing. Um, I like being a part of the helping process and part of that means that um, we collaborate. So while I have the education and experience that um, might benefit you, you are still the expert in your life. And so uh, I use that to kind of help with therapy. Okay, great. All right, the next question is, what do you think is a strength that makes you different from other therapists? Mm. Well, um, I think it's a little bit of all that I've already talked about. I mean, um, I think I'm very personable. People have always kind of described me as like this kind of cheerleader in, in therapy. Um, I kind of just help people with what they need and, and meet them where they're at in that moment. And um, typically this ends up working really well for teenagers because I don't know about you, but teenagers can't be told <laughs> nothing. And so um, I just, I just kind of go with the flow. And I think that that's kind of just what makes me unique in, uh, in the therapy room. Okay, great. And the final question is, what makes you most passionate about helping people with their issues and concerns? Yeah. Um, I think just being a part of that change. I think it's just super cool to watch people go through the different stages of change. Um, if you're not familiar with it, you know, um, some people become uh, aware of, of wanting to change and sometimes they lose that motivation and then they get back on track and all of that is just kind of a fun ride to be on. Um, and I just like helping people. I just, I just enjoy it. And so to me, um, I guess just being a part of it is, is the cool part. Okay, great. Well, thank you so much for taking the time to do this interview as well as let people who are watching this video get to know your personality a little bit more. So I really appreciate you taking your time to do this. Absolutely. Thanks for having me. All right. Take care. Take care.